yeah, we were called in there to um, get one family out, the two adults and the two children, and we did so um, in the short amount of time that it even took to um, load them into the back of the, the, of the council tip truck. Um, the water rose uh, probably at least a foot, um, and again was flowing really rapidly um, down through that area. So myself and uh, my two colleagues made a decision that uh, while we were here, we would evacuate as many um, as many of the residents in the immediately, you know, the worst, I suppose, affected area that, that we could. We managed to load a, a total in the end, uh, 39 people on board in the back of the truck. Um, uh, that was a total of 21 adults, six elderly, um, and one disabled gentleman and nine children. It was quite emotional for all of us as well, I mm. think, uh, seeing all the little children getting off with their with their handful of toys and things, a couple of things that they love the most. We've um, been tasked to jump into one of the tipper trucks and we've just assisted carrying property, animals, whatever we could, um, pile them all into the, the tip truck and um, transported them to the evacuation centres. But everyone was very appreciative and a big thank you to all the businesses that have just assisted in any, in any way possible. Um, having warm food was always a nice treat for us as well and a, and a hot cup of coffee. Um, we were, it would be wet, drenched all the way through, so it was nice to just even have something warm on the day. So very appreciative and uh, it's just nice to see the community coming together um, and supporting each other.